What's up, everybody? Welcome to the Homie Hangout, where we help others move in excellence. And this is actually a funny story, right? So uh, you guys know I got some family out in Reno, and uh, and I have some relatives that have been inside the Washoe County Jail. So this dude, old Fred, Frederick Atkins, Freddie got himself in some trouble yesterday when uh, when he got picked up for felony possession of a controlled substance, failure to appear, um, you know, parole violation, right? So nothing super dramatic, you know what I mean? Um, but so he's in the back of the police car and the cop is taking him to the Washoe County Jail and Freddie decides to tell the cop, I got a gun, <laughs> right? Now, mind you, he was patted down and searched during the arrest process. You know what I mean? I, I would presume that to be true because I've never heard of a situation where that is not true. So he's patted down, whatnot. Um, and, and a gun is not necessarily the easiest thing to, to conceal in a pat down. Maybe the cop did a poor job. I've heard of that before. Um, but nonetheless, he's sitting in the back of the cop car. He tells the cop, I got a pistol. I got a gun. <laughs> So the cop panics, right? He calls the county jail and he's like, hey, I got an armed suspect in the back of my vehicle. So they pull up to the county, SWAT team comes out, they surround the vehicle. Um, the cop dips, right? He hops out the car and for hours, right? Like two, almost three hours, they're out there negotiating with Fred, right? And Freddie's insisting he has the gun now. And... So finally, they shoot some gas inside of the, you know, inside of the cop car. Freddie gets gassed out. They pull him out of the car. And of course, they find no gun. So he kicked up this big old stir and had everybody out there negotiating with him when he didn't even have a gun. He was playing a game, right? Um, now, he has a history of drug use. He's busted with felony possession. Um, safe to say there's a good chance he was intoxicated, right? Um, at, at the time that this happened, uh, meth is a terrible drug, boys and girls. But, uh, but yeah, so now he's booked not only on the possession of the controlled substance and the, the failure to appear and the parole violation, but intimidating a public officer, which is a felony, obstructing and resisting, which is a misdemeanor, destruction of property, because he's being blamed for the destruction of the cop car because it was him committing a crime that required police to, to uh, uh, vandalize the cop car or, or you know, mess up the cop car by shooting the gas in there, right? So yeah, um, I, he's, he's in trouble, but I personally, in terms of standoffs, right? When you hear a standoff happens, and when you hear a standoff happens at the county jail, which is kind of how the, the media, you know, locally up there has been presenting it. Uh, when I first heard about it, I thought it happened within the jail, right? Which, which that would be a whole different story. You know what I mean? That's, that's some, uh, you know, that's some like Black Panther, you know, type stuff. But, but no, it happened in the parking lot because he said he had a gun. And so... I've never heard of anybody making a claim like that before. I'm not sure really what else the officer could have done. Um, you know, I mean, I guess he could have looked, right? He he could have looked back there and seen if he saw a gun. Uh, you know, I suppose people could have got closer to the car and signed some lights in there and see if he has a gun. But maybe he just panicked, right? Um, uh, I, I don't think they have a protocol for what do you do when, when somebody in the back of the cop car says they have a gun, but, um, but yeah, that's, that's what happened. Uh, personally, I think that the cop overreacted and, and that's what led to this. Uh, I wonder if folks are making fun of the cop or, or, you know, what happened with that, but what do you guys think? Uh, leave something in the comments, man. This is a very quick video. Uh, again, standoff Washoe County uh, jail in the parking lot, old uh, Freddie Frederick Atkins. Uh, 
decided to tell the officer that he had a gun in the back seat uh, after he was picked up, excuse me, for uh, for possession of a controlled substance, parole violation, and failure to appear. Everybody freaked out. Uh, SWAT team came, they negotiated with them for hours. They find a, you know, wind up firing gas inside the car. They go inside the car. They realize he doesn't have a gun. So now he's booked on intimidating an officer, resisting arrest, destruction of property, yada, 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 yada. Help others move in excellence, man. That's what homies do. Help yourself at the same time and help your community because it needs you. And stay tuned. I got some more uploads coming up today. And uh, of course, there's always more content. Take care.